So I'm out doing some weeding and I thought, oh, why don't I grab my phone so that I can show you some of what I'm doing? But then I got stopped because Howard is doing some drywalling and I drywall repair and I had to assist with that. The reason we are having to repair this drywall, why Howard has to repair this drywall, is because we got an exciting new television. And in the installation, some holes were made. So I know that I am ridiculously bundled up, but I am a California girl and 64 degrees is cold. California has been blessed with rain and we are experiencing a level of lush, beautiful, gorgeous, fabulous weeds. It looks beautiful. It looks lush and gorgeous. But all of these weeds are drowning out the plants that I planted intentionally. This is a California poppy. This is a daisy. And this is a California poppy. And all the rest of these little MFers are weeds. And I have to pull them out by hand so that these can show. So when you're wondering where Monique is, it's not fun. It's not cinematic. It's just a crap ton of weeds being pulled on a chilly but sunny California winter day, late January. Ooh, the wind makes my eyes water. <laughs> Zen garden packed up for winter. Tiny little area where I've pulled the weeds. And everything I have left to do. This will be a multi-day thing. We purchased two chalkstick plants that we planted on our mesa and they have grown so much and we have taken so many cuttings off of them. We have planted them all over our yard. Everywhere that, well, right there. Everywhere that is a kind of a neglected place that we can't get to in water, that's where we have planted these chalk sticks and they are thriving. They are doing great. They are very water wise. Got a few weeds in there. Tighten that up. We bought two chalk stick plants for $20 each, a $40 investment. And we have now got cuttings off of those that cover most of our yard in the areas that we don't really get to. So really a good investment. Okay. We got it cleared around the orange tree and the daffodils and a little bit up here. Got it cleared for the most part around the lemon tree. Got lots of little tiny blossoms I see. So let that get some nutrition. Those weeds were thriving. They were sucking up all that fertilizer. So probably time to refeed that tree. A plant that died right here, pulled it out, adding a new succulent that should be very pretty here. And, you know, 
Jake and Howard do all the work. <laughs> That's why I love her. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so, real quick, okay. here's our gopher protection, which may or may not work, but... Fingers that, crossed. Yeah, it's one of the baskets that Mo and I make to try to keep the gophers from eating their roots. Uh, Fits in I nicely. Think, I think I need to go in a little deeper, or do you think that's good? I mean, I'm going to... Yeah, I think it's okay. I think it's okay. Yeah. Think so. But, you know, here's a thought I have, because... The soil's going to come up here, which is going to kind of leave a little bit of that exposed. I'm thinking maybe just an inch more. Or you could fold it in. Eh, I could. But yeah, anytime you reach your hand in there, you'll cut yourself. Yeah, I so. think uh, just a little bit deeper, not more. Okay. And then I'll be ready to start filling in and put whatever, what's the name of this? I don't know. I can't remember. It's right here. It's... <laughs> Teddy Galanthus Tetris. Okay. I don't have glasses on, so I can not see any of that. Price. Yeah. So we hope it uh, does well. Yeah. We do. <laughs> <laughs> okay, back to okay. weeding. weeds cleared out for the most part wherever I have bulbs coming up. I have quite a few more days of work in here, but we're getting a good start. Look at these daffodils! Yay! Looks like the lavender is doing well. Lots of daffodils coming up. Well, I've got a lot of work left to do, but um, any day working out in the garden is a good day, even if it's a little brisk and windy. But uh, yeah, I got a lot of work left to do, but it's good work. It's uh, very satisfying. Nothing like spending a day out in the yard. Thanks for joining me. I love you bunches. I hope you have an awesome rest of your day, and I will talk to you very soon. You know, after I'm done weeding. <laughs>